By 2026, we may be on the brink of a new pandemic, one born from the chaotic, unsanitary depths of wet markets and wildlife trade. Imagine it, these cramped, teeming spaces, packed with live and dead animals stacked in filthy cages, blood and fluids mixing, becoming a breeding ground for something truly deadly. Experts are warning us now, saying these markets are ticking time bombs. The next pandemic may already be lurking in one of them, waiting to explode into a global catastrophe worse than anything we've ever seen. Picture it, a lethal virus evolving in secret jumps from animal to human without a sound. Patient Zero is a vendor, an innocent shopper, a child in the crowd, and the virus begins its deadly journey, spreading invisibly. Within days, it could travel across borders, hopping continents, touching down in cities worldwide, and this time, it could be faster, deadlier, unstoppable. But there's more, a double threat. The rise of antibiotic resistance is making its way into these same markets, with bacteria that have adapted to withstand any drug we throw at them. Imagine a future where not only viruses, but also superbugs emerge from these hot spots. They are silent killers, resistant to medicine, ready to strike without warning. This isn't just a call to action, it's a wake-up call for survival. With a connected world, one single market infection could spiral into global devastation. Experts are saying that without urgent intervention, without shutting down these dangerous trades, enforcing strict sanitation, and cracking down on antibiotic abuse, we're staring down a biological nightmare, a perfect storm that could put all of humanity at risk. The question is no longer if the next pandemic will happen, but when? And the answer could be sooner than we think.